We've been waiting all week to hear this major announcement from the NXT champion, so let's find out what he has to say. There's been a lot of rumors and innuendo going around social media the past few weeks, so I'm here tonight to set the record straight. My big announcement is that everything you read is true. I was, in fact, romantically involved with Candice LeRae before she married Johnny Gargano. That's right, she was mine before she was his. It all started in 2015 when Johnny Gargano had just signed with NXT. He put every ounce of his time and energy into making it here and becoming the Johnny Wrestling that you know today. But to achieve all that, he ended up spending more time with his tag partner, Tommaso Ciampa, than his romantic partner, Candice LeRae. Candice was lonely, <laughs> and things got worse when her boyfriend didn't have the guts to ask NXT management to consider signing her too. She started to think that maybe he was intentionally holding her back, scared that if she got a chance in NXT, she would outshine him. Nonetheless, she needed a shoulder to cry on, and that shoulder was mine. We dated for a bit and it was okay, but then I got bored and broke things off. And that's when she went crawling back to John. They ended up getting engaged and <laughs> the rest is history. So that's right, Johnny. Everything you've seen and heard is true. Your wife is a fake. And if you or anyone else doesn't believe any of this, that's okay. Because I have proof of every conversation Every late night text, every DM, it's every Johnny Gargano. He heard enough. And Gargano's taking it to the NXT champion. Can you blame him after everything that the champion said? Well, we don't know what's true or not, but one thing's apparent. Johnny Gargano is extremely upset. We know these are lies, and so does Gargano. That's why he's so angry. The NXT champion clearly wants no part of this, happy to stir the pot and then run away. He's not running away, he was attacked. You expect him to stand there and take that? I don't know what to expect, but hopefully we get to the bottom of all this sooner rather than later. This guy is the real deal. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Beverly Hills, California. Weighing in at 290 pounds. The NXT Champion, Max. The Savage! This guy was respected everywhere he competed on the independents, but there were peaks and valleys when he trained with Booker T. He can be his own worst enemy, but Book gave him the crucial foundation he needed to make it to WWE. That's it! Time for him to get it.
The future has arrived. A man who bends limbs, joints, and time itself. And his opponent from Tokyo, Japan, weighing in at 192 pounds, Kushida! Trained in both pro wrestling and MMA in Japan. Kushida was undefeated in eight mixed martial arts fights, and he brings those same submission skills now to WWE. What are you expecting from this superstar tonight, guys? Well, he did say earlier that he's going to attack his opponent with a renewed hostility that we've never seen before. Yeah, he also said he's going to make the competition a big for mercy. Also in the ring is Kushida, a man whose innovative offense truly makes him ahead of his time. Kushida is constantly inventing new attacks and looking for new ways to tie his opponents up in knots. Yeah, a real genius for wrestling. It's only a matter of time before you see the latest and greatest from Kushida. When you combine his ingenuity with his indomitable fighting spirit, you really get something special. And this one might be headed ringside. Yeah. Nothing fancy here. Backbreaker. Backbreaker. And Kushida is failing to offer any resistance now. Kushida needing to weather a storm here. Sliding back into the action. Three. Drops the hammer. Right on the lower back. champion looks to be in complete control of this match. Despite all the outside noise, he's locked in tonight. It's Johnny Gargano, and he's all over the champion. Gargano's lost it. Wouldn't you after everything the champion has said about Candice LeRae? Speaking of Candice, it looks like she's here too. And she didn't come empty-handed. Candice LeRae is going to get some revenge on the champion for all the lies and disparaging remarks. How do you know they're lies? Wait, what is Dakota Kai doing here? Well, apparently she sided with the champion in all this. Dakota nails Candice with a chair. Low blow to Gargano. I can't believe these two are working together. <laughs> DDT out of the chair. We've seen Dakota Kai chime in on the champion's claims on social media, but now she just took her support to a whole new level. I don't know about anyone else, but I'd really like some answers right now. Whether there's any truth to all this or it's simply just mind games from the champion, it's certainly taking a toll on NXT's first couple.
Well, misery loves company. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring. Max the Savage and Dakota Khan. I hate to think what these two have planned for tonight. You gotta believe they were conniving a scheme in the back. Conniving a scheme? You gotta stop with these Saturday morning cartoons, Saxton. It's called coming up with a game plan. A plan that can pay big dividends. This is just like the fan fiction I wrote. And their opponents, Johnny Gargano and Candice LeRae. I love this. Two people who exemplify that you can try hard, never cut corners, and earn big things here in WWE. Well, they say birds of a feather flock together. I just hope poultry's on the menu for their opponents tonight. A <laughs> good line, Corey. I'm the best. of NXT to settle an issue that stuttered over allegations that have rocked the locker room. It's rocked the entire WWE Universe, Cole. It doesn't get any juicier than this, and you have to love it. Oh, grow up, Corey. Does anybody actually believe the NXT Champion's lies? Here's a better question. Does it matter? The NXT Champion has Gargano in the palm of his hand either way. Oh, no. An ankle breaker. What a counter by Gargano. Was ready for that. He's got something in store. Up and down. What a slam. Ooh, He's on his heels a bit now. This is when you have to take advantage of tag team rules and get yourself some breathing room. No good reason to stay in this right now. Gargano is finding himself at a disadvantage. Gargano has to retreat and rethink his strategy. A counter answered by another counter. Typical guy hiding behind his woman. Oh, good night. Sorry. She catches Kai with a big counter. And another counter. Uh-oh. So much damage inflicted. These guys have been looking to beat each other up for a while, and now it's their chance. 
Float over. Oh, Float over. Nice. DDT. And more hits up there can leave you dazed. Straight punch. John. Vicious. There's Gargano with a counter. Series of reversals. Oh, back elbow. Great wherewithal on the counter. He was waiting for him to make his move. Oh, neck twist. Ruthless. Isolating the arm. A relentless attack here on Johnny. Johnny's lacking his usual instincts here. Spinning Brain Buster! Uh-oh, double underhook. This is gonna be nasty. Pile driver! Gargano's in a crisis here. Team win here for this guy and gal. This kind of win puts both men's and women's divisions on notice. Excellent teamwork in that win. And here we go. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the NXT Championship. Introducing the champion, accompanied by Dakota Kai from Beverly Hills, California. Weighing in at 290 pounds, he is the NXT Champion, Max the Savage. Here we go, guys. The championship is on the line here in this one. And I'll tell you, Cole, the champion has never looked more dominant than right here, right now. Yeah! Many are predicting a title change here tonight, but this man is looking to prove otherwise. Introducing the challenger, accompanied by Candice LeRae from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 199 pounds, Johnny Gargano! What an ovation! Johnny Wrestling! What's it about Johnny Gargano that makes him as good as he is today? Unparalleled heart. 
Johnny Gargano has been through it all in his career before arriving in WWE. And now that he's here, it's a dream come true. Johnny will not let his dream slip through his fingers. Johnny Gargano is that guy who's not going to complain. He's not going to cry over spilt milk. He's going to keep working hard, keep putting in the time to achieve his goals. This building crackling with anticipation as the NXT title is on the line. Things have really escalated between the NXT champion and Johnny Gargano, and it all comes to a head tonight in this no DQ championship match at NXT TakeOver. I still don't believe the garbage the champion's been spewing, but this is why I stay far, far away from love triangles, Michael. They're just too messy. You're in luck, Saxton, because Dakota Kai makes this all square. Although I'm still trying to figure out what her angle is in all this. And he gets his shoulder up before the count. These men knew this match was going to be hard fought. Well, that didn't go as Johnny designed. Driver spiked him. The challenger eating up some damage. Just rake in the face. Ah, rake in the face. Oh, look at this aggression, just oh, pure brutality. Come on, easy. And the NXT champion takes control. Irish whipping Gargano into his corner. Hold on, it looks like Dakota Kai is trying to remove the opposite turnbuckle pad. Uh, maybe she's fixing it. Luckily, the referee saw her and will put an end to this cheating immediately. Speaking of cheating, Candice LeRae now getting involved. Candice LeRae with the jawbreaker. And Gargano now with the super kick. champion Johnny Gargano has done it again. What a moment after all he's been through. But it didn't happen without some level of controversy. Gargano's wife Candice LeRae now handing him the NXT championship and that's exactly what she did when she got involved in the match. Dakota Kai would have done the exact same thing or worse. It doesn't take anything away from Gargano's win. The former champion from behind. And Candice gets sent flying off the apron. She hit pretty hard. And suddenly for Johnny Gargano, jubilation turns to concern for his wife. We all just hope she's okay. Maybe we do, but the now former champion looks content to have gotten some form of payback on the first couple of NXT, intentional or not. I have a feeling this is far from over between these three.
The following contest is a last man standing match and is for the NXT Championship. This guy is ready for a fight. It's a big fight feel here tonight as the title is on the line. And title matches like this have a way of getting your blood flowing unlike any other match. He's told anyone who will listen that he always has been the uncrowned champion of this division. Now he can make it a reality. soul to find who this young man is. What's it about Johnny Gargano that makes him as good as he is today? Unparalleled heart. Johnny Gargano has been through it all in his career before arriving in WWE. And now that he's here, it's a dream come true. Johnny will not let his dream slip through his fingers. Johnny Gargano is that guy who's not going to complain. He's not going to cry over spilt milk. He's going to keep working hard, keep putting in the time to achieve his goals. Introducing the challenger from Beverly Hills, California, weighing in at 290 pounds, Max the Savage. And introducing the champion from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 199 pounds, he is the NXT Champion, Johnny Gargano. A sold-out arena on hand for what promises to be another war for the NXT Championship. There's a chance that the NXT Champion just looked at his title for the very last time. The NXT Championship may have switched hands, but the drama remains the same as Johnny Gargano and his opponent. But to settle this saga once and for all tonight, Gargano's opponent can never get his dignity back after he was exposed as a liar and fraud, but he does have a chance to salvage his former title against the new champion. The low road, the high road, does it really matter what road you take as long as it ends up in a championship? No. Oh, that'll break his arm. Vicious. Gargano showing his alertness there. Staying in this one. Deconstructing the knee there. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. With Lariat. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? 
I guess he thinks the one thing missing in this match is a steel chair. The champ taking their share of hits now. Ah! An agile escape. Face first into the chair. We are witnessing a malicious string of attacks right now. Running Hurricane Rana. Fantastic. Jarring impact. Oh, stomping away. Oh, drop kick to the spine. their disposal considering this match can end up anywhere in this arena. Referee's count has reached seven here. Getting dangerously Eight. close to the inevitable. Superstar trying to stay a step ahead. Those last hits rattled the champ. They're both just doing anything they can to ensure victory and be the last one standing. Strike punch! Interrupting the count. Probably looking to deal some more damage. He turns it around. Reciprocating the initial reversal. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Precise. And he's already taken more hits up there than he should have to handle. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Got him hooked. DDT planning. And Gargano's failing to make any advances. Johnny needs to decipher a solution to this situation fast. He's got him scouted. Gargano isn't taking this lying down anymore. Gargano trying to bring the fight back in this one. Reversal after reversal. These two are ready for each other. 
Look at this, going counter for counter. Sequence of reversals there. And Gargano saw that coming. He just barely dodges. Will Will into the match, and he still seems so fresh. It's almost unbelievable. And he can't defend any offense coming his way. He's got to boost up his levels of aggression at this point. Ooh, what a counter! He's trying to bring the fight back in this one. What is he doing here? Oh no, get down from there! Get down from there! You don't have to do this! We're gonna finish things off right now. This will do it! Can we get some help out here? You know, the best time we could have gotten some help out here would have been before they went to the table, Saxton. Someone to put some sense in their mind before doing something so reckless. Something left in the tank. Oh, that startles Johnny. He's showing it's not time for lying down. It's time for fighting back. And he's been concentrated on that area throughout this one. He knows every blow there weakens his opposition more each time. There's some power behind that punch. And Gargano is failing to make any advances. Johnny needs to decipher a solution to this situation fast. And these attacks up in the neck area have gone way too far. Listen, someone needs to ring the bell before this situation loses. Stop pulling pile driver. Measuring. Producing some overwhelming offense. He's taking charge here. Oh. Johnny anticipated that. Back and forth from these competitors. Shifts it back onto him. And he goes into the ring. He stands up and stops the ref's count. You can't keep him down. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a play. Counters. This could be an opportunity. DDT. And Gargano is falling behind. Gargano has to retreat and rethink his strategy. And he's debilitating forearm strikes. Searching for something. Three. And of course, kendo sticks are always under the ring in the event of any rogue ninja attacks. Ooh, man. Oh. Oh, come on. This is just too much. I agree. The ref had already started to count. Yeah, he's able to stop that surge dead in its tracks. Brain Buster. These consecutive attacks have him reeling. Yeah, he's got to surmount this storm coming at him. Looking to pile on more offense rather than let the count go on. Kendo stick to the score. No. Measuring. What a counter by Gargano. Excellent opportunity for Gargano to shift the momentum. Instant opportunity for Johnny to turn the tides. Re-entering the ring. Not allowing that to go on any longer. A relentless attack here on Johnny. Johnny's lacking his usual instincts here. These two showing how well scouted they each are. His fist connects.
chance for him to get back into this match. Really amazing display of athleticism. He will go on. Gargano gets reversed. it up close and personal. Stop making this about you, Saxton. This is about the new champ. 